All right, so we're just getting out of our car to go into Target, and our gang stalking Oceanside police just came, just came in the front of the store. Now, nobody is really looking out for the average person, though a group of Republicans in the House of Representatives are trying to investigate the DOJ and the FBI for their illegal surveillance of Trump. But as far as illegal surveillance of the average person, nobody cares. And as a matter of fact, uh, Congressman Louis Gomer just said that he's being surveilled. So now our criminal intelligence agencies are making examples of members of Congress, for instance, that question the Mueller investigation, while average citizens like me are going through being gang stalked by our neighborhood watch groups, the Reds, who wear carry red, drive red cars and trucks, and our gang stalking police. Now, police and firemen, ambulance drivers should be ashamed of themselves because what they're doing is trashing the Constitution and validating what is called the post-constitutional society, a society without the Bill of Rights. That's what this police officer in this SUV is sanctifying, a world without due process, without um, charging a person in this post-constitutional America. You can gang stalk a citizen and say hello to the red car uh, for over a decade and there's no consequences. Of course, there's no one to give consequences. Congress can't even save themselves because now Congressman Gomer is being surveilled by our criminal um, intelligence agencies. Now, Americans can just let this go on or you can raise bloody murder and you can scream bloody murder uh, and you might start when our gang-stalking policemen ask for a raise.